time. We're getting like Scott now. Hi, everyone. Sailor Moon here. Sailor Mars here. And today we're going to talk about what is the Viz one while is the Deke one is Deke one as bad as folks like to say it is. First off, when we talking about the Deke one, we're talking about the one that Deke had the rights to work with from 9 between 95 YL, well, 9 between 94 YL till 9 between 98 YL before the rights were given over to Cloverway. And a lot of folks out there like to think that, you know, have, don't like the Deke Sailor Moon either for, oh, the names being shifted or stead names being shifted or stripe names being shifted or how some followings were skipped over all some sagas were skipped over or how some of the fighting was taken out some don't like it for the way that the show players did the speaking for themselves and sundry it's other grounds you know and some folks don't like it because oh it wasn't the way that it was <clears throat> it wasn't the Sailor Moon they thought it would be. Now, at the end of the day, everyone has their right to their beliefs, their takes, and their thoughts on it. But I don't truly believe that it's as bad as they make it out to be. I mean, names being shifted isn't a big deal. You know, a lot of drawing shows from other worlds, other lands, I need to say, did have their names shifted or they did not. Sometimes they did, sometimes they did not. Alright, and as far as stead names being shifted, yeah, I don't think a big deal about the stead names being shifted. You know, a lot of folks don't really make a big deal about near names or earldom names or Reich names <clears throat> being shifted. And as far as the strike names being shifted goes, yeah, I won't, don't really see a big deal about that. And as far as making a big deal out of some of the sog some of the sagas there not being worked on at all, at the end of the day, I don't really think <clears throat> I don't really think it's a big deal to do that and make a big deal for that. You know? But you see in the Sailor Moon followership, the Deke Sailor Moon is either this one that a lot of Sailor Moon followers out there don't like because it's not like, it's not like, because <clears throat> it has a lot, they don't like it because a lot of things were shifted about it, you know, or they show play as if it's bad, but I don't really think it was. I mean, for a lot of these folks that are don't like it now, if it wasn't for the Deke one, no one would have known what Sailor Moon was, and there would have been no need for Viz to do any work with it if there wasn't a Deke one or a Cloverway one to work with. I mean, a lot of Sailor Moon followers out there always like to, you know, behave as if it was a, a sin against drawing shows, a misdeed against drawing shows. And you know, I wasn't that bad, you know. Yeah, <clears throat> you want to go on now? Yeah, Sailor Moon, you're right. The Deke Sailor Moon did have a lot of things that were shifted out, you know, like, like borrowed names, you know, like, like <clears throat> having Frenchis or Latinus or Hellenists or Hivuis or. Spanish or Farsius borrow names borrowed out for the Donish borrowed names. Stead names being either shifted out or not being there at all. Or strike names being shifted. I don't really think that was as bad, you know, as folks make it out to be. You know. And at the end of the day, I don't think it, you know, I've watched it many times and it's not as bad as they make it out to be. You know, it's not some sin or misdeed against the drawing show as some folks like against drawing shows like some folks like to make. 
you know. So at the end of the day, yeah, it's not flawless. I didn't say that. But I don't really think all the, and you know, and all some fighting being skimmed out, I don't think it's a big, <clears throat> a big deal. You know, it's not that bad. And why some folks in the Sailor Moon followership makes a, make a big deal out of it is beyond me. You know, you know what? I just think you folks make a big made a big deal out of something that wasn't really meant to make a big deal out of. And hating it for those grounds, well, that's sad too. You know. The names, the bar, all borrowed names being shifted out for borrowed names isn't a big deal. You know, a lot of folks who spoke English or, well, most of them know some borrowed names more than they know other borrowed names. Well, hopefully they know all the English names first before they know all the other borrowed names. And very few of them might know the Frenchist and the Latinist and the Hellenish and the Spanish and the Hivuist and even the Farsiest borrowed names more than no no Donish borrowed names. Sorry. And as far as the strikes being shifted out, you know, Toei shifted the strikes too from for all the five following. They didn't keep them the same. And as far as stead names being shifted out, yeah, unless you live there, you know, you're not going to know all the stead names, the near names, or the earldom names, or the Reich names. So yeah, they're going to shift them out and put names that folks speak English would more know. And as far as having, you making a big deal about all the fighting being, you know, skimmed it out. They didn't skim out the good, all the fighting. Back to you, Salomon. You're right, Sailor Mars. At the end of the day, folks making a big deal about the Deke Sailor Moon and all the skims and cleans and cuts that were done to it. You know, I think that some folks just like to make a big deal out of things because that's what they like to do. And the grounds why we have talked about this sundryous times because it's still a thing. You know, it's not like the hate or the unlike of it has gone away because no it's still there you know say what you want to say about it but at the end of the day we will always like the deke one and we don't think the deke one was as bad as you folks make it out to be if you like this film then follow us over here at Salem Moon for Life watch the other film we made yesterday over here I Salem Moon Serena I, Sailor Moon, Sail Marge Ray, or Sailor Red World Ray, and we'll see you later. Goodbye. Always go to leave me to end my films.